after you purchase Haiku Deck Classroom from haikudeck.com forward slash get classroom, you find yourself in the classroom management dashboard. To start, educators must create courses. Each course includes a list of participating students and provides a unique gallery that students use for contributing their work for your review. You can create as many courses as you want, and to add a course, you just click Add a New Course, or you can import from Google Classroom if your school uses Google Classroom. Right now, I'm going to show the manual option of just entering in a course name and clicking the green Add button. Next, we have to add students to the class. So, most teachers will do this manually by copying and pasting email addresses right into the Invite Student box on the right. You can use commas or returns to separate the student email addresses. And that you'll notice that as students are added, the number of invites available will count down. If you run out of invites, don't worry, just click the Get More button below the counter which will redirect you to the page where you can purchase additional student licenses. After you've added the student email addresses, choose the course you want to add them to from the drop-down list below, and then click Send Email, and this will email invitations to your students. Students who are new to Haiku Deck will have to click a link in the email to create their account with us, but existing Haiku Deck users will just see the features of Haiku Deck Classroom appear next time they sign in. To delete a student, just click the trash can icon next to the student's name, and to resend the email invitation to the student, just click the green envelope. A new feature of Haiku Deck Classroom is the course gallery, and this is a private presentation page for the educator to use for reviewing work that students submit. Only the teacher can retrieve the gallery link, so it's private unless you share the link with others. Each course gallery is unique to that course, and to retrieve the link, you just click the blue link button and then click the copy link button next to the link. To open the gallery, just paste the link into the address bar of your web browser. Students can add and remove decks from the gallery, but only Haiku decks with public or restricted privacy settings can appear in the course gallery. To add a deck to the course gallery, students can use the green Add to Course button when they're signed into the app on the web. They can also add to course from the Share dialog in the Haiku Deck iPad and iPhone apps. Remember, to access your classroom dashboard anytime, you can click on My Classroom from the drop-down menu under your name. Of course, we're always working to make the app better for students and teachers, so if you've got any feedback for us or need any assistance whatsoever, please email us at education at haikudeck.com.